Nearly 300 people have been reported missing in Ohio this year alone, and to help support the families of the missing, local nonprofits are working to support them. Clara Faith is live in studio with how one local nonprofit is helping families this Easter. Clara. The Doc Ellis Foundation is a local nonprofit that supports the families of missing people across the country. This Easter, they're gifting Easter baskets to children who may have a loved one or parent missing. Michelle McConan Lester is the sister of Nicole McConan, who went missing 21 years ago in Richmond, Indiana. We did everything you could possibly think of to look for a missing loved one. Now she works with Doc Ellis Foundation, a local nonprofit that supports families of those missing. In the 21 years that I've been searching for my sister, I've worked with a lot of organizations, ran across the Doc Ellis Foundation. It seems like that they were just there to help look for a missing person. They was there to support their families. Mm -hmm. Lester began working with them closely, and now she is helping families try to enjoy Easter, like the family of Sierra Chapman, a Dayton woman who's been missing since December. See, so I have went out and got some stuff to make, to make some Easter baskets for some of the kids that their parents are missing. And she tells me she knows how it feels to have a missing loved one. The reason for that is because when your loved one is missing, holidays are really, really hard. And the goal is to make life normal for all involved, including the children, as they continue to search for their parents. That I spent because sometimes people don't have it to give, and we still want to make sure the kids have somewhat a normal Easter. Now, the Doc Ellis Foundation tells me this week, three families will be reunited this weekend, uh, this, sorry, this Easter. If you'd like to donate to help this foundation, go to the web version of this story where I included a link. Now back to you. Clara,